I just set live Emmeline's um, Posh Pack video and she's getting ready to film my Monster High video. Monster High video. And I'm going to wear my Monster High pajamas. Malia is doing her homework. Oh, she she's has, almost done. Yeah, her, um, she has winter homework. Yep. What about you? Go check your bag. Don't play with that, Dylan. You're going to hurt yourself. So I started vlogging really late today. Most of the morning I spent, um, finalizing my orders for Stella Dot because I recently signed up to be a stylist because I went to a party, trunk show party, and I love all of the pieces and then I figured to sign up. Minette signed up so then I signed up under her and yeah so I was finalizing all the items that I wanted to order to start my kit, my samples, and um I'm having my first trunk show party. Me and Manette are hosting it together on Sunday. So we're really excited about that. And then I was talking to um, the Jen, who is the girl that we originally signed up through. You met her through the mom mixer. And Manette won a trunk show party. And then that's how Manette signed up. And then that's how I signed up. So I was on the phone with her. She's just giving me you know, the lowdown on um, things I need to know. Why do I keep vlogging? Why? Because it's Vlogmas. Oh. <laughs> Bonita femur. It's a hybrid doll, two in one also. And it's a hybrid doll. Of course, I um, told you on the other Freaky Fusion doll that hybrid means t two in one doll. And her name is Bonita. I have been home all day. I didn't leave the house. I intended to take the kids out to run errands with me, but yeah, that didn't happen. So luckily I can leave them for a little bit because it's really, really cold. My parents are gonna watch them when my dad is. Um, I have to go to the bank. Oh my God, it's such a funny thing. I was going through my mail and I found two checks and I ripped them up by accident. I was like, oh my god, let me check what was in there because I ripped it up right away. Idiot. And there was two checks in there. So I hope I can still deposit it even though I taped it back up. The scan bar was not ripped. So I'll see when I go right now. Um, and then I just have to um, run an errand real quick after. But I'll take you guys with me. I can't stay out too long because the kids home oh my god success the bank took the checks I have e-banking so I was like worried um, but I get so nervous when I go to the bank or the ATM at night especially when there's somebody behind me I get so paranoid but yay I'm so glad they took it even if it was taped up so funny happy place <laughs> there's kind of traffic but uh I have to exchange something here, and I have a gift card, but I don't think I'm going to use it all Let's see what they have. Look, there's these new Real Techniques brushes. So pretty. Kind of pricey though. Of my time in there <clears throat> I didn't get anything because I was trying to return something and they wouldn't let me return it because they say it was past 60 days from when I got it and I don't know I'm just not in the mood to buy anything because the most they were trying to give me for a Lura Pro 2 palette was $18 and that is worth way more than that and I just put everything back because I was just like I'm not gonna just get $18 for the Lura Pro 2 palette like I'm better off giving it away than getting only $18 for it when it's like $42 so I don't know and I had the receipt but 60 days 
I don't know, it's so stupid. I haven't been here in forever, that's why I haven't um, gone. And I was gonna get something there, but then I was just like not in the mood. I have a gift card there too, but I was just like, I didn't wanna add money because I have something that's of value. Anyway, I'm ranting. I was texting Christine telling her I was annoyed and that I'm leaving. It's so funny. Uh, I was there way longer. And I was supposed to be I'm just gonna try to run in and out of here quick. It's like one thing I wanna get. I'm like so beyond my curfew. I went into Target, but I didn't vlog because I was on the phone with Manette the whole time I was in Target. <clears throat> I just had to get a couple of things I forgot to get the other day, like shampoo and bubble bath for the kids, pop baby powder. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I'm like way past my curfew. I said I was gonna be, I told my dad I was gonna be back fast. I was gonna go to the bank and the store. And then I ended up being gone way longer than, I don't even know if you guys can see me. Anyway, I'm driving home now. I just went to get the kids um, Dunkin' Donuts and myself a coffee. I've been kind of craving a Dunkin' Donuts coffee. And I'm on my way home. Hi guys. Whoa. Were you being good while I was gone? It's not morning. Were you being good? Yeah. I bought you bubble bath. I bought you a new bubble bath. So we took a bubble bath later. Daddy, I mean mommy. I thought I heard um daddy ping. So that was you. Oh yeah, I burped. You sound like daddy. I sound burp. like daddy when I burp. <laughs> so I'm drinking my coffee. I just ate my dinner, chicken noodle soup. I'm gonna enjoy my Madonna. You got it. And you got the left. Dylan, what's wrong? Crazy day. Dylan, you're. Again, mommy thinks. Okay. Mommy thinks Michael's vloggers. Why are you doing? Keep doing videos. Why not? You don't like. You don't like. You don't like to be in the video. But but you too. You take too many videos. I take video every day. Also, I like, you don't I, like to be in the video? You can not, see it when you get older. Are we, are we doing a, um, doing a bubble bath today? Yes. <gasps> Yo! Look at how good my kids are playing. I was on the computer and texting some friends and then I turned around like, why is it so quiet? Because Emily and Malia are playing Lego friends and Dylan is playing with his Legos. Lego Chima. Lego Chima. Because I just bought this um, container, like the best $7 I spent. Hold on, it's so loud. Why is it so loud? And I designated a drawer for each of them. Be careful, Malia. I want to squeeze it and pull it out. Yeah, there you go. And they each have their own drawer. I think there's more pieces in here, like big pieces. And some pieces in here. But, um, so that they can just. Oh, it's blurry. So they can just pull it out when they need their drawer and build. Okay, guys, you keep playing and we're going to do bubble baths. Yay! Okay. We should be doing bubble baths now, but I mean, it's vacation mode, so I'm like not, we're not on a regular schedule. Not that we're, our schedule is great to begin with, but my friend Brandy, Brandy Loves Beauty, just ordered her IMAX tickets. And I'm like, oh my god, the pressure is on to order our tickets. And IMAX is in April. April 11th or 12th, like that weekend of, I think that's Easter weekend. I know that's the the week, the last weekend of the kids' spring break and then you go back that, they go back to school that Monday. And Minette actually um, texts all of us that the tickets went on sale, I guess at some point in December, end of December. And we're like, oh my gosh, we're not ready to order this. We have to get through Christmas. And now that Christmas is over, we're like, I'm not ready because I have my um, Stella Dot um, party with Minette on Sunday. So we're probably gonna be ordering, well I had to order some stuff for that. Um, but hey, you guys were just being so good. And um, so I don't know, we have to order those. And the prices keep going up. They said it's $60 a ticket. I think last year was, or I think when it's we started going was like 40, 45, 
Maybe last year was 55 I don't remember, but I feel like it goes up $5 every year or more. It's a rip-off. <laughs> it's insane. And plus, you still spend money when you go there, but I mean, we don't do it for that. Like, now we do it just to hang out with each other. Just an excuse to have, like, our day in the city and go eat out. Um, but I told the girls, I was like, gosh, when it gets to, like, $100 or, like, even way before then, I feel like I'm going to have to retire from going to IMAX in the next two years because the ticket prices are, if it keeps going up $5 every year, that's insane. It's insane. So, unless we can get free tickets. But, um, anyway, I need to start working on, look at my face in this. I need to start working on, not that video yet, but, um, my, my, uh, Vlogmas to post today for, um, vlogmas 30 from yesterday and my computer is so weird right now it's like so slow and delayed like i'll press on something and it'll take forever to get to that so i don't know what's going on even through my internet like even i'm just pressing this i don't know what's going on uh. do you guys watch this show little couple i watched them like a long time ago when they first like i think before they got married or when they first started having a show and I just like stumbled on it again like a few weeks ago and I think this is their new season so they have they, since they got married and stuff she's been through she had cancer and she went through chemo and was cancer free now I think um, or at least that was the last episode I saw yeah because her hair's going back in this one so I think this is a new one and those are their kids they adopted a boy and a girl and they're so cute I'm like hooked on it now me and the kids watch it because we like watching the, their little kids they're so cute and look at they're still playing when it's on clearance look six dollars you like this six dollars 